Hey guys, this is Jen from Scan and Cut Jam Sessions and Scan and Cut Canvas and Scale Help on Facebook. This tutorial is about grouping, ungrouping, and the break apart feature. Okay, so here I have um, this is our little buy page, um, little uh, avatar. So I have it in here. Well, if I come to preview, there are no cut lines. So how do I do that? Well, let's see. I'm going to come up here. Uh oh, I can't ungroup it. Well, I can break it apart, right? No, with this one I can't because this one is a place image. So the only thing you can do with items like this is you can come to the trace. So click on trace and that pulls that up, okay? So with a place image, this is the only way that you can break it apart, ungroup it, and create cut lines. I'm going to go get another file. Okay, so I just brought this one in. What a holy mess this thing is, right? Well, we got to click off it, click back on it. We'll come over here, and we'll change the color. All right, so there she is. But the things that I want, oh, goodness, are not visible. They're see-through. So this is when you go in and you do the negative. To capture the image that you want so you just pull oops let me pull this little guy over here okay so do it like that then you got to come back in and re-highlight them don't forget that because a lot of people are like oh it won't work we'll do a back minus front or sometimes it takes a front minus back whatever and wait for it to work mm, that's not the one we want so let's do the front minus the back and see what we get. And wait for it to work. Takes forever. Okay, so here she is. And you'll just erase these lines over here, but I want to, we got to come back in here and re-highlight this. I'm going to change the color so we get a better view of it. Okay, so there she is. Well, I need to cut this. I want that cut out of a different color. I want the bow to be, let's say, a pink, and then I want this cut. Well, I need to come up here and ungroup it. Uh-oh, can't do that. So I need to break it apart, and look what happens. Okay, well, come over here to the paper icon and click the Show Outlines Only. Okay, so that's going to allow me to individually pull these pieces out, and I only use the directional lines, okay? That's all you want to use. Okay, so I only use the directional arrows so that nothing happens. It doesn't resize itself, anything like that, okay? And to separate them by color, again, just start making pages that you can assign a certain color, all right? So do what you want in here, but that is how you need to, um, anytime you have a JPEG or a PNG, any image type file, you will need to break it apart. All right, so just remember to come and click the show outlines. Then when you're done, come to object and click merge. All right, and because this was not set, back on top of there it's not going to change back into its normal color it'll still be this dark color but it really doesn't matter because all you want is that outline because you'll be cutting it out of vinyl or cardstock whatever okay okay now I pulled in an SVG and I want to come and I want to be able to individually or actually like as a group to be able to duplicate this so I need to separate it somehow well let's see what we have here aha so we do have the ungroup. So now I can come in and I can select all these and I can duplicate them and do what I need to with them. Okay. So hopefully this video kind of helps you to understand um, the ungrouping and grouping and the breaking apart and what you need to watch for and the things that you need to use to be able to effectively um, separate your files. All right. If you guys have any questions, you can find me over at Scan and Cut Canvas and Scal Help on Facebook. Thanks, guys.